Hi friends, I am Amanda. Welcome back to my channel. This is Chloe. She is going to be joining me today in the Byredo sampler review, but I'm going to specifically be reviewing the Gypsy Water and the Blanche scents. I have already reviewed for you guys the Baldoff Freak because I have been really, really, really obsessed with it. So I did a separate video for that. And what I started doing um, with Byredo was Mojave Ghost. I discovered it from using the Way Leave-In Conditioner and that is how I discovered Mojave Ghost in general. Um, and that is definitely my favorite, favorite Byredo scent, followed by Baldoff Freak. I love it. I'll put the card up here. You guys can check those videos out. Um, but today I just wanted to hop on here and talk to you guys about Gypsy Water, which has been like really, really highly recommended to me when I mentioned I like Byredo. A lot of my clients are like, oh, Gypsy Water? And I'm like, oh no, like Baldoff Reek and Mojave Ghost. And they're like, you gotta try Gypsy Water. And you'd love it, it smells so good. And then I have another client who loves the Blanche um, hair perfume. So I wanted to just definitely get this sampler. I thought it was a great way to try scents. They're pretty significant. They're 0.4 ounces and they, um, all three of these together retail for 120. But before I dive in, you guys, I just want to say welcome back to my channel. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. And I post a new video every Friday, so I just have to get that little spiel out of the way. So um, let's get into it, all right? Let's talk about Gypsy Water first. People love this scent. Chloe loves it as well. Yeah, she likes it. It's really, really like feminine and pretty, but it does have those kind of like earthy notes that I love. Um, which are like vanilla and sandalwood and amber. Those are the base notes of gypsy water, okay? Delicious and sexy and a little bit heavier, a little musky. Um, the opening notes are lemon and bergamot, and then you have some pepper and juniper berries and incense and pine needles. It's a really, really, um, it's so delicious. Like, I don't know. I, I feel like this is like a signature scent. You could wear this every day. It smells so, so, so good. What do you think, Chloe? You like it? Yeah, she likes this one. Um, and I totally get why people wear this all the time. And I do think that it's like not a scent you get sick of. It's not too heavy. It's not too, um, like, I don't know. It's kind of well-rounded because it does smell kind of like on the sweet, creamy side when you first smell it. And then it does, you do hit that like um, vanilla and sandalwood kind of notes, which you guys know I love so much. So I am thinking about, I think I'm gonna get a bottle of that actually, like a full size bottle. Um, I really like it. So I wanna say thank you guys for recommending that. Also, let's talk about Blanche. Blanche means white and the perfume maker kind of describes this scent as how they see the color white. So. I think this is kind of like a springy fragrance. Like I'd want to wear this in the spring when the weather gets a little nicer and sunnier. Lay down, Lay down. Okay, she needs to relax. <laughs> so Blanche, okay, florally. Um, I'm not a huge floral person, but that's probably why I think it would be good for the spring. Oh, I think she might like this one better than Gypsy Water. <laughs> um, yeah, I would say it's a really good fragrance for spring or even summer. It does have notes of white rose and um, pink pepper and violet and sandalwood and musk. So it does have some of those scents that I love, but I would say it's like a lighter everyday kind of clean, like kind of like what you think white would be, I guess. I guess that kind of makes sense. Like white, when you think of the color white, I think of like fresh and clean and new beginning and that's also the how I think of spring fresh light new beginning everything's coming back to life so I definitely get why people like Blanche and I think in the spring I'm going to try wearing it even though I'm not really into like florally scents I've worn it like only two times because the Ball da Freak and Gypsy Water have like stolen my heart big time um so I love it the fragrances, like full-size bottles, range from $190 to $270, and you can buy them from Byredo. They do like free shipping and free returns, and you get two free samples with your order, or you can order from like Nordstrom or Saks or 
all different places online. So I'll make sure to link everything below, but I do want to let you guys know, I think it's such a good idea to order like a sampler pack because then you get to like wear it a little while. You can tell like what you like, what you don't like. And without making the huge investment, spending like $300 on a scent that you may not really, really love. So I don't know. I, I definitely think Balda Freak stole my heart. Like I said, I put the card up there for you guys. Check it out. I love it. Um, and then I would definitely say Gypsy Water. It's like a hard second in the sampler. I would say Blanche would be coming third for me, but that's only because I associate it with like a spring and a warm weather type uh, perfume. And I live in New England and it's like very rarely spring here. So, but I do like it. It's beautiful and it's clean. And it's just, I think you people would like it on you. It just, it's a, it's a fragrance that I think a lot of people would be like, oh, you smell nice. Like a lot of people would probably like Blanche. So that's it. Um, I hope you guys found this video helpful. I know it's a little short and sweet here, but I just wanted to touch base on these three. And if there's any fragrances you guys want me um, specifically to get and review, I will. Um, I love doing fragrance reviews and I love trying new perfumes. I do have a list of more perfumes that I need to do. So if you guys have any questions or anything, like definitely let me and Chloe know. Chloe loves trying out perfumes too. She's definitely into fragrances and she loves being on camera. So um, I hope you guys have a great rest of your weekend. Make sure to follow me over on Instagram. My name is Amanda J. May, and I'm also on Like to Know It, which is a free shopping app, and I will make sure to link everything for you below. But my name um, on there is Amanda May, and what I do is I link things to Like to Know It that I also link in this video. So if you guys follow me on Like to Know It and you don't watch all my videos and you're not subscribed here to this channel, you can see, because I will post every week, everything on Like to Know It that I'm talking about in YouTube and on Instagram and vice versa. I try to cross, cross uh, pollinate all those channels so that you guys don't miss anything. So, all right. I hope you guys have a great weekend and I'll see you here next Friday.